the runners and riders for the third race of the afternoon, the supporting event, the Mayor's Cup now for Class 5 Handicap, 1,600 metres on the racetrack. In the picture in front of you, we've got three of them. You've got number four, Admiral, sporting the all-green silks. Number five, Stormy Petrol, black with the red sleeves. And already on his way there, without the rider, Stockwell, who's be sporting the first colours of Mr. Asira Dasanayake. So, number two, Stockwell being taken riderless to the 1600 metre marker. A little full of himself was uh, Stockwell. Coming out now onto the racetrack, but that's the lineup, ladies and gentlemen, for the Mayor's Cup, Class 5, handicap 1600 metres. Number one, Christmas Cake, being ridden by Mohan Raj, trained by Jayantha Vijasinghe. Number two, Stockwell, trained by Lalit and ridden by Parmar, drawn six. Number three, Cosmopolitan, trained by Vijasinghe and ridden by Dinesh, drawn two. Number four, Admiral, trained by Madhya Lingam Lagan and ridden by Suganath and drawn one. Number five, Stormy Petrol, trained by Madhya Lagan and ridden by Mahesh, drawn three. And number six, Captive Heart, being ridden here by uh, Kishore Kadam and trained by S. Lalit. Stormy Petrol, so, and they're away in racing, so they've managed to get them all in. They're off to a level start, and Stockwell jumps, uh, Captive Heart jumps out quickest to take the running there from Cosmopolitan in second position. Then we go back a length there to Stormy Petrol in third. Christmas Cake is in fourth. Up on, just on the inside there, Admiral, and up on the outside there is the one who created all the trouble, Stockwell. They've hit the rising ground now, and it continues to be... Uh, Captive Heart, the leader, on a start-to-finish essay. Captive Heart by about two and a half lengths from Cosmopolitan. Christmas Cake is in third. In fourth position, running about four wide is Stormy Petrol. Tucked in on the fence, about five lengths adrift there is Stockwell. And in between them is Admiral. As they straighten up now for the final run-in, and it's, uh, it's Stockwell who's the leader. Stockwell has uh, hit the front by about a length and a half there now from Cosmopolitan. In second position then. In third place there comes uh, Christmas Cake. A length away then behind Christmas Cake there is Stormy Petrol. Uh, and just behind Stormy Petrol we go back a length and a half there to Admiral and uh, tailed off his captive heart. They've got a little over 600 to run now in the Mayor's Cup and uh, it continues to be Stockwell, just the leader, being pressed for an effort all the time by Christmas Cake on the inside, just behind them is uh, Stormy Petrol, a length and a half away then, Cosmopolitan and uh, Admiral. Round the turn into the straight, and Stockwell wins it back. Stockwell by about a length there now, from Stormy Petrol coming up on the outside, then there's uh, Christmas Cake, but they're all in hopeless chase, with 100 to run now, and uh, Stockwell walks away with the Mayor's Cup, five lengths the good there of uh, Stormy Petrol, then came uh, Christmas Cake, followed there by... Cosmopolitan in fifth position, then was Admiral, and last off there was Captain Hart. So there it was, Stockwell gave them trouble, but the handlers persisted, managed to get him in, and in the end, he proved to be just far too good for the rest of them. He gave Parmar an armchair ride. It was Stockwell who'd hit the front from the very beginning. Stockwell led them all the way. At one stage, you did seem to have a bit of a problem coming about, but he won it well. So the unofficial verdict, number two, Stockwell first, number five, Stormy Petrol second, and number one, Christmas Cake is third. That's the one, two, three in the Mayor's Cup, where Stockwell played up merry hell before the start of the race, but once he got into those gates, no trouble at all. He got straight down to business. Parmar had him out in front from the very beginning, and after that, it was smooth sailing. The only one who came up with a slight challenge there was uh, Stormy Petrol. And that's the replay for you. They've jumped out of the gates. No one really interested in going to the front except, except for Stockwell, who makes it on his own now. Stockwell goes to the front by about two and a half, three there from Cosmopolitan. And uh, Christmas Cake was in third. Stormy Petrol being held back in fifth position. And just behind them was Captive Heart, who was last most of the way. No real appreciable change in the order, as it continued in the same vein with Stockwell on a start-to-finish mission.
Christmas cake managed to wriggle up onto the inside for a little bit, but no threat really. Stormy Petrol drifted out a bit in the straight, coming in very, very wide, but for which might have finished a little closer, but no hard luck stories. Stockwell was the best horse on the day. He wasn't the best behaved getting into the gates, but once he got in, he just left the opposition standing in his wake. So Stockwell from the stable of S.D. Lalit, written by N. Parmar, and from the yard of Isara Desanayake, that's a back-to-back -back double for them. A wonderful double here for uh, the Isara Desanayake stable with Stockwell stretching out to win the Mayor's Cup from Stormy Petrol, Christmas Cake, Cosmopolitan, Admiral, and Captive Heart. So Cosmopolitan returns, uh, uh, Stockwell returns in triumph here for the Mayor's Cup. And the official verdict, number two, Stockwell, written by Parmar, first. Number five, Stormy Petrol, written by Mahesh, second. Number one, Christmas Cake, written by Maharaj, third. That was the one, two, three for the Mayor's Cup, where Stockwell had just far too much stock for anyone in that opposition to get at. Thank you.